And my picture is on nothing. And I could argue no, that no, the perfect no, owner no. is a way bigger draw in Lancaster <laughs> than you know, Roger and me. This, this, is not, this, this is not how this is supposed to work. We're all supposed to be working together, not against Ricardo, each other. we can work together, but you have to be smart about it. We the issue is Bro Keller. He was not supposed to touch J.S. Hawthorne, and he did. Again, I said it last night, there are rules. It's not the Bro Show all the time. Well, maybe you should talk to me before you uh, 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 fill up on fast food. One thing I will tell you, Mr. Rogers, if you are going to be the face of this company, Maybe some of that gym equipment should go to your place. You're a great name in this industry, and, and it's why the Lancaster Commission of Wrestling has, has, has kind of latched on here. You gotta be able to fit on the flyer at Homecoming on July 13th at the Brightside Opportunity Center, back where you started Free Legacies Wrestling. We are going to put Ricardo Roger Guiz in the ring again. None other than J.S. Hawthorne in a title match. Well, what is it that you want me to tell you? That, that, that I'm being forced into a situation that I don't want to be a part of. That for the last two years, I've been able to prove that we have been able to build something special. And now we have people that are telling me that I have to face J.S. Hawthorne at homecoming. This isn't what I wanted, but this is what I'm going to do. I did sign up to become the face of Blue Legs Wrestling. I have proven for the last two years that Ricardo Rodriguez is a heart and soul of 3 of And now, Three Legacies Wrestling presents Hong Kong. Nice arm drag right there, Parker. All right, and a reversal. 
Oh, look at that. They both went for the same arm track. Well, the tag team division here in Three Legacies Wrestling, uh, both of these young teams are jockeying for a position. And while Nice and Smooth have been teaming longer than Super Generation, Super Generation are kind of the hometown heroes here as they are Three Legacies Wrestling born and bred. Tom Mitchell up against AJ Morales. And solidly behind Super Generation. Tom Mitchell, a bit of, well, I guess all of these guys are going to be here. Uh, came pro in uh, May of 2022. Just going to two years. He's in there with AJ Morales. But AJ Morales and Jesse J are. Again, just like I said earlier about Byron Simmons, these guys, they improve every single time they're out there. They pick up stuff, they learn stuff. Beautiful, look at that swinging arm drag right there. Tremendous That was amazing. I don't even think I've ever seen something like that before. I think Just Jay is ready to get in here. <laughs> nice fake out right there. Wow, beautiful spinning. All air from wow. AJ Morales too. This kid is Look at this. This kid is just amazing. Beautiful high cross body. Cross body. Hooks the leg. Hooks the leg. Hooks the leg. Only gets a two count there. Oh, actually able to kick out of that. AJ Morales has always been an athlete in really basketball, soccer. He was on the track team. He was on the wrestling team. Just Jay, the kid who has said more than once, he's just a kid who's excited to be living his dream of being a professional wrestler. And here he goes with a low drop kick in the Stop corner. Here. The passionate protagonist, Just Jay calls himself, goes for a cover, hooks the leg, only gets a two count again for our first lady. Tag once again to AJ Morales. AJ Morales holding on to that tag rope, too. I like that. I like the following tag of the tag team. Comes some oh, little corkscrew assist there from his tag team partner. AJ hooks the leg. No. Only gets a two count again. Smooth Tom Mitchell is the veteran in this match, although he is still relatively newcomer. But again, he has a little bit of that veteran instinct going. Oh, Mitchell I think he was going for a tornado to the team. Yeah, was. Oh, I think he caught it. In. Oh, oh beautiful! Suplex. Suplex. Wow. That was beautiful. I don't think 
I think they oh, they, sorry, sorry, they underestimated, I believe, yeah, the Super I, Generation. I, I, Again, like I said earlier, they're not big guys. I mean, they definitely have a size disadvantage um, over Nice and Smooth, but I think, wow, I think, uh, both, I think both guys, Mitchell and Parker, have like underestimated the Super Generation. Now we're starting to see some aggression coming out of Tom Mitchell here. This is the aggravation that you mentioned earlier. I think he's uh, it's letting it the best of him and uh, put in the face. I, I almost can't blame him though. You take a slap. Wow! You're going to get offended. A huge tornado DDT wow, here. Wow, beautiful but I, tornado DDT for AJ Morales. I think mean, both Just J wants in this match. Look at the energy on Just J. Both Just guys are right down now. right now. Wow. Just Jay just willing on his partner here. Jay wants to take this match real bad. AJ's got to get over there and make a tag. He's, he's right there. There he goes. Go. Both guys tag. Just Jay injured. Just Parker in there with Just Jay right now. Mitchell's still in there. Kick to an insecurity to Tom Mitchell. I hope Jay realizes. Yeah, he does that. that Mitchell's a little guy. I don't think Jay cares right now. I think right he's there. just taking it. Oh, a big uppercut right in the corner. A huge. Mitchell oh. stops the move from Parker. Parker went for the oh. What we got here? Stomp <laughs> right on the small of the back. Double stomp right on the back. Yeah, hooks of a leg. Man, this has been a ton of action in here so far. Well, you said it. We're, said we're right just getting started tonight. You said right at the beginning of the match that you expected yeah. there to be a lot of athleticism on this play here. You weren't wrong. Yeah. I didn't use the word that big. That's what I meant. Man, these guys are just oh, super generation, man. I, I, I said this earlier, but, but super generation just gets better and better every single time they're out here, man. Wow, beautiful super kick. Parker off the Oh, wow! He turned him over with that. Wow, just almost lost his head. I don't know if he got a haircut or if he got a, his hair fell out from that close. Wow. All four men are down right now. I mean, of course, two of them legal, two of them not, but they're all down right now. Ref Bruce is up to five, I believe. Wow. Man, that close line almost took him out of his boots. He might have a lot of cardio in the tank, but eventually that tank's going to run out. I don't know. We haven't. Oh. These guys, I don't even think they got their quarter down yet, Super Generation, are they? They are taking it right now. Whoa! A <laughs> little bit of an assist there. Both guys on top of the cover. Oh, wow, wow. What a kick out. Two guys on top of the yeah, cover. Was, was Ref Bruce has got to get one of, the, one of them out of there. I was going to say, I don't even think I know. I didn't. I didn't. I hope Ref Bruce did. Willing the fans behind me. Might be a little. Parker gets out of it. Parker with the right hand. Just Jay with the right hand back. Parker with another right hand. Just Jay with another right hand. And another. We're trading right hands here. I'm trying to call them all, but man, it's fast. Tom Mitchell attacked himself. And AJ Morales is the same thing. The same. Wow! Oh my god! <laughs> He looks like a rag doll. How do you even call that? He just threw him. Oh my god. Morales went for the wow. 6 1 0. Nice and smooth connects. And that, wow. that's going to be it. Wow, what a match. What a display wow. of athletic Absolutely on tremendous. Here. Nice and smooth and super generation. Oh my god. Just kicked off this homecoming show and tore the house down. Tom Mitchell just threw Just Jay like he was a like dirty a, napkin. Yeah, he just tossed, tossed him. Wow, and then he hit the top rope with his legs and flipped back. Man, I have never seen anything like that before. That was Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, it is my pleasure to introduce to the ring. The assistant oh. to the commissioner Come on. of Three Legacies Wrestling, Bring Rensburg. A lot of enthusiasm, Carolina Jim. Very excited to bring out Bryn Rensburg here. 
I didn't even know she was here. trip while you're getting in the ring. How could they not know who she is? son out of the building last month. Bro Keller's just out here notice, having a good time. Notice Bro Keller not dressed to wrestle tonight. I mean, what is, what's going to happen here? Peace, 
getting a big chant from the crowd here. Look at this. Lancaster's own Larry Peace. The next match is sponsored by Red Rose Sports Cards, Lancaster County's premier sports card one stop shop. We buy the train. That's Red Rose Sports Cards, 126 South. Center Road, right here in Lancaster. Introducing Way out one, 165 pounds from Tonga Beach, the Bahamas. He is the superstar, Merrick. His opponent, accompanied by Prince Parana, <laughs> weighing in at 222 pounds from every TV imaginable. Accompanying Al De Niro? Uh, yeah, Prince Parada. Oh, wow. <laughs> Go Yankees, baby! I need a throat loss uh, Al De Niro in Merrick, Miami right now. Merrick, Miami is a guy we haven't seen here in a few months. He has been applying his trade all across the U.S., wrestling everywhere he can, improving as well. Al De Niro, although does not look impressed with him, neither does Parada. Parada, by the way. I spoke to Merrick Miami earlier today and asked him what uh, any new accomplishments during the journey away from Free Legacy's wrestling. And he just looked at me and said, I've got a win over Matt Cardona. I was like, okay, that, you told me that over a year ago. Yeah, he told me that a while ago. And he repeated it again. But I've got a win over Matt Cardona. And then he walked away from me. Matt who? Zach who? Al De Niro, the main attraction, says he lives life like it's a movie. We're about to see. Yeah, we're about to see the opening act, I guess. That's the right here. It looks like Al De Niro's got an inch or two uh, height advantage over Miami. Oh! <laughs> Eric Miami trying to sneakily get a boot up right there, but De Niro able to catch it. Shoots him off. Nice hip toss right there. Miami walks, just walked right into a body slam. It looks like beautiful slam. Miami walked right into that. There with a nice splash. A little, a little early a cover right there. Him. Yeah. Only got a one count in America, Miami. You said it was short feet, right? Out in here with a couple of knees to the uh, bread basket as they bring the close to us. A heck of a movement so far. Miami had two count bets on this season. Lancaster's own referee Larry Pizza recently. I must remind you. Oh, big shot right to the back. That was a big forearm right to the back of Eric Miami. I don't think uh, I don't think De Niro is impressed with who anyone that uh, that Merrick Man is going to victory over. I think all Al De Niro cares about is having a victory over Merrick Miami. Yeah, this could be his Emmy his Emmy moment right here. Of course, a huge moment moment of Emmys for TV, or whichever one's for the movies, this could be that moment. That's what I mean. Yes, this could be uh, De Niro's Oscar-winning performance right here. Huge backstab. Kick out on a two. Whoa, that was an elbow right to the back of the head. Man, that, seeing that hurts me. And now a boot to the back of the head. I know what kind of movie Al De Niro's in right now, but this is the part of the movie where the protagonist gets in trouble. Now, I would assume Al De Niro's the protagonist of his own movie. Philly! 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 Oh, he's 
one of the characters. Wow, this running knee right there. Got a short running knee in the corner. Got right? kind of a rock the hero a little bit.
Miami. Smart move there. The crowd not approving of that, but smart move. Duck down, roll out. If you want to take yourself a breather, except when you got your opponent right behind you like that. Okay. That kind of puts an end to the breather. But... Oh, what is it? He's going to try to post them. No. Oh, man. Merrick Miami ducked down behind him and posted him. De Niro going for the post right there. right behind him. Doesn't remember. De Niro with a roll up. This could be it. Oh, wow. Very, very close. Merrick Miami just a hair away from kicking out. Ooh. Just a, just a hair away from getting hit. Welcome to Miami. Wow. And he got and it. That's it. Boot right to the face. Right to the face of Al De Niro, puts him out. Man. Merrick Miami just blew a kiss to the Al De Niro fans in the front row, and now. I thought that was to us. Now Piranha on top of the superstar here. Oh, ben Miami, yeah. yeah, what a great match that was. Great back and forth. Well, I don't think Piranha and De Niro are done with Merrick Miami here. Oh, the Almighty Syndicate. Oh my God, it's Merrick. Diesel and Dallas. Those are Merrick Miami's allies here. Because Dallas just chased his ref Larry out of the ring. Ref Larry going for the bell. I ain't gonna do nothing with these guys. Merrick Miami, of course, a disciple of the Temple of Boom, has teamed with both of these men in the past. Man, and Kiesel is not getting any love from this Lancaster crowd. He did just do that L symbol on his head, though, for Lancaster, right? That's what that means? Lancaster? Or Lebanon or Luna Beach, something like that? Merrick Miami victorious over the main attraction L. Oh, man. De Niro and Piranha both laid out the right The Almighty Syndicate came in to make sure that their ally got out of harm's way. Almighty Syndicate, which we will see in action later tonight. De Niro and Piranha challenging all three of them, Miami, Kiesel, and Dallas. Three on two handicap match, I think is what he's asking for. I mean, they didn't say they had a third man. We're looking at two on three right here. Oh, wait a minute. But don't worry. At the Red Rose Rumble, I have somebody in mind. By We Like Wrestling Podcast, the premier wrestling podcast in Pennsylvania, we bring a fun and lighthearted take on pro wrestling past, present, and future. You can find them on YouTube, Pandora, wherever you find podcasts. That's We Like Wrestling.
either one is impressed with each other. She doesn't look like 
like she's trying to win this match. She just looks like she's trying to hurt her. Yeah. Hey, sometimes that's the best you can do. just screaming for help. Slow and drop takes Zoe Cannon down, but Cannon manages to kick out. That was a beautiful slow and drop. Cross body hooks the leg and gets the three count. Zoe Cannon has victorious here against the larger and tougher. No, I'm Joe. Thank you. Your next match is sponsored. You said, by Are you Jim? Wrestling no, I'm Joe. Recovery. They are an organization providing guidance for the recovery of an addiction. That's wrestling and recovery. Your next match is set for one fall. Introducing first. Weighing at 38 rocks from the Chuckles of Jersey, the Tarzanian Devil, Tarzan Durant. His opponent, weighing at
jobs. He's telling, he's telling them outright to hit him. Move towards his hair the way so he can go on the side of the face.
Bak. most hard-hitting matches we have seen in three legacies wrestling in a long time. These two guys just beating the heck out of each other. Wow. That's 
every time he was here. Yeah! He's your boy! Now Stuckey got a lot
way in there now. Oh, oh man, he, he brought Kiesel out there daydreaming. Now he's taking it to Ace Dallas. Wow, nice pump in the slam right there. I think Conway is feeling it. He's feeling the gobble bull power, I think. up on the top right now. Nice drop kick on Ace Down. Scissor kick by Jimmy Conway. Dallas Angels is both down right now. Tells him not to do something. I don't know if you want to do it. Gentlemen, our main event is brought to you by the Lancaster Commission of Wrestling. Jason Smith and Bryn Renner decided that
Came to our table and grabbed the title belt. I don't know. 
Wait, I don't know what's going on here. Someone just. Champion. Champion, I don't know who that was that ran over here and grabbed the title belt from our table, but they had some kind of mask on and a hoodie. Now Brim is back.
Well, folks, I'm glad you joined us for a moment. Lancaster.